Hey guys, welcome to my garden. Today I'm gonna be trimming these giant cabbages. I'm gonna be trimming these big leaves from these giant cabbages. There are three main reasons why I usually trim off my cabbages in my garden. The first main reason is that I use these uh, huge leaves for mulching for other uh, crops. I use them for mulching. And the second reason is that when you trim off uh, these giant leaves, you will save more space. You will note at the end of the video, you will notice that I have now uh, created a lot of space after trimming these leaves more space will be created meaning you can also plant other crops in between the cabbages you can see after trimming you can see how tiny the leaves looks now this is another reason why i usually trim off these huge or these giant leaves from these huge cabbages most more space will be created in between these cabbages in other words, these leaves grow out and even block the sunlight for other uh, crops in between these cabbages. So trimming them is a, a way of creating a space, more space for them to continue growing. And also other uh, crops will also get enough sunlight. The third reason why I am trimming off uh, these cabbages is because the leaves, the giant leaves, especially the yellowish or the rotting or the old leaves, they can simply allow the spreading of diseases from one cabbage to uh, the other especially when they are very very big so by uh, trimming off these huge and old leaves you can minimize or reduce the chances of spreading or of allowing uh, diseases to spread from one cabbage to the other note that in my garden i am growing more than one type of uh, cabbages you can tell that I have the cape split, which is the uh, the heart shaped, and also the head drum. This one is the head drum. This one is almost ready for harvesting. Uh, so when trimming, I trim every cabbage in my garden because I hate the old leaves because they, as I've mentioned, they can also allow the spread of diseases from one cabbage or from one crop to the other so after trimming you can tell how neat and small or tiny they look this is how much leaves i have trimmed from one cabbage Another reason that makes me want to trim my cabbages that often, I hate it whenever I don't see the ground. Whenever I want to walk through these cabbages, you can't see the ground. So after trimming, you can tell that there is more space in between these cabbages. Well, in some cabbages, you can tell that shoots are also growing in between these huge uh, leaves look at how tiny is this cabbage after trimming and look at uh, how much uh, leaves i have trimmed from this single cabbage look at how much uh, leaves a lot of leaves and more space has been uh, created around this single cabbage.
when I was trimming this cabbage plant, I noticed that there was a, a tomato plant nearby that was dying. Look at this tomato plant carefully. You'll notice that the shoot of this tomato plant is not getting or was not getting enough sunlight and it was starting to turn a yellowish look at that and it was dying because it was got not getting enough sunlight because of these cabbages in nearby there was a blocking the sunlight from reaching the tomato plants Look at how tiny is this cabbage after trimming. This one is the head drum cabbage and it's this one is ready for harvesting but I'm not gonna harvest it anytime soon. So after trimming this cabbage is this is how th they look very tiny. So now I have enough space for planting other uh, crops and also I can clearly see the ground now. Please like, share and subscribe. Thanks a lot for watching.